Hello, hello, Tatum here, welcome back. Today, we're gonna do a stretch, so grab a mat and some water, and let's get to it. All right, welcome. We are going to get started today. Today, I have a little bit of stretching for you. All right, this is day 16 of our Fall Into Fitness Challenge, where we bring workouts and home follow-along workouts to you daily. If you are looking for some variety for your in-home workouts, please remember to subscribe. Like I said, seven days a week. Today is a stretch. We are going to get started. We are going to use the wall for part of our stretching today, just a little circuit. So make sure that you're near, um, near a place where you can get to the wall fairly quickly as we're just gonna kind of flow and work through this. 20 second holds, 10 to 20 second holds on most of this with different circuits. Our first one is going to start here. I want you to bring your right foot across your left, hips to the right, reach. We're reaching left here, hips are flared right. I want you to breathe. If you're having trouble breathing, I want you to come up out of it just a bit, out of that bend. Good job. We're gonna step that left foot back into a very deep lunge. We're gonna reach over that knee. Some of us may need to stay high, that's okay. If you can, try to touch. Look up if you'd like. Get a little bend here. Three, two, and one. Nice work. Now we're gonna bring our left foot, wrap it around our right. We're gonna push those hips left, and we're gonna reach right. Folding over to the side here. Notice that my left shoulder wants to tilt in. I'm gonna reach it up towards the ceiling and stack these shoulders a little bit better so I can feel that stretch more. Three, two, and one. Good job. Bring your right leg back. Come to that floor in that deep stretch again here. We're gonna reach over that knee. Today, we're really gonna focus on elongating and reaching, okay? Some of the things we forget about a little bit when we think about, oh, our tight hamstrings and our hips. Good, is how tight we can get through our midsection and our sides, right? All right, right leg over left, hips to the right again, reach left the wind. I don't know if you can see the leaves are coming in. It is a fall windy day. I love it. Nice work. Step that left leg back. Nice deep lunge again. Reach over that knee. Look up if you want. Look down if you need to. Breathe. Great job, all right, let's come back up to the top. Left leg over right, hips to the left, reach right. Again, stack those shoulders, feel the stretch. If it's too difficult to breathe, come out of it just a bit. Three, two, and one, good. Step that right leg back. Here we go, reach over that left knee. Feel that stretch. Three, two, and one. Nice work, all right, come up out of that. We're gonna flow through a little bit here, hamstring stretches, okay? I want you to start with a forward fold and I'm gonna bring my chest to my knee, or to my thighs. So I'm gonna bend down just a bit here and fold over. Now I want you to come to your shins, flat back, reach your head towards the uh, opposite wall. Here we go. Hold here. Good, now step that left foot forward into a hamstring stretch. We're gonna reach out in front, flat back, pull those toes back. Three, 
Good. We're gonna come into another forward fold here. I gotta bend a little bit because I like that on my tight hamstrings. You can stay uh, with straight legs if you're there. Good, we're gonna slide up into a flat back here. We'll half fold, just reach out. Top of your head towards that opposite wall. Good. Now we're gonna come into that hamstring here, pull those toes back. Reach out over that straight leg with a nice flat back. Really reach, pull those toes back. Good, back to a forward fold. Good, straight legs, flat back. Really reach through the spine here, through the head, towards the wall, elongate in the spine. Good. Bring that left foot forward, toes back. We're gonna bend over, straight, flat back. Good. We're gonna go back into that forward bend. Breathe. Slide up to your shins. Nice flat back. Good, now bring that right foot forward. Pull those toes back, straight leg. Reach out, flat back over that leg. All right, that's time, good. Moving on. We're gonna do another side bend, okay? We're gonna do a lot of bending back and forth. We'll go right, left, right, if I plan this right, okay? <laughs> All right, we're gonna do a side bend again this time. Palms together. All right, reach. I like to kind of let rest my head there on the arm. Shoulders are stacked. And breathe, find your breath. Good job. Let's step back with the left leg here. Come to your knees. Right leg out here. We're gonna go ahead and reach towards the right. We just did a left bend. We're gonna go right, half kneeling here. Look up at your hand if you want. Good. Now we're gonna come up over the straight leg and reach. Looking out. Nice work. Breathe. Good job, come on up. We're gonna reach right this way, palms together, head on arm, just relax. And breathe, get that stretch. This is already feeling easier to bend and stretch here from doing the stuff we did earlier. Good, we're gonna come down here. We're gonna reach out away from that leg. Hand down, look up if you'd like. Top leg extended here. You can look down at your hand if that feels better. Out to the front or up. Good work. Slide it up and we're gonna come over that straight leg. Here we go, hold and breathe. I really love this one. I like the one when we're down, but this one being up feels just as good. Not only am I working on the stretch in my adductors, but getting the stretch all through the side of the body, which feels so good. All right, nice work. One more round for me. We're gonna stand up to the top here. We're gonna fold over left, side bend here. Palms together. 
Shoulders stacked, reach. Nice work. All right, step back here. Oops, other way. <laughs> We're gonna reach wide here, away from that straight leg. Look down, forward or up. Good. We're gonna come up to the top now. We're gonna come over that straight leg again. And Ben, this is a tough one for me but it feels good. Three, two, and one, good. Let's stand back up one more time through on the other side, palms together, head on arm here, shoulders stacked, hang out and breathe. Sometimes you can breathe and stretch a little further out and fall a little deeper each time. Good. We're gonna reach left now. Away from that extended leg. Breathing the entire time. Come up. We're gonna reach over that straight leg now, okay? Good, look up, forward or down. Breathe. Last one in this sequence here. Good job, come out of it. All right, this is where I want you to find your wall with me, okay? We just have a couple exercises here. Find your wall, bottom to wall, legs up. All right, just flex those feet, hold it here. Get as close as you can, feel the stretch. I love doing this while I'm watching TV <laughs> in the house. <laughs> All right, just because gravity, or because you can do this and relax and let the wall do its work. Now we're gonna bring this right leg down into a single leg, kind of like a happy baby, just pulling down. You can pull outside here if that feels more comfortable or inside, just like your happy baby. Pull that knee down, press on that foot. Three, two, and one, good. Bring that right leg back to the wall. Bring that left leg down. Breathe. Now we're gonna straddle the wall here, okay? Bring your feet as wide as you can, getting a stretch in those adductors. I really prefer the wall position here because I am so tight and this is a really hard thing to do on the floor. Um, this just feels easier to let gravity. I feel like I have to work very hard to bend into a straddle position. Whereas here, I can just kind of relax my back and my core and let gravity do its work. <laughs> All right, bring those feet back together. One more round for me. Wait, uh, legs are together. You can flex those feet. Hold and breathe. We're gonna grab onto that right foot inside or you can grab the outside, okay? Bring that knee down, hopefully you can see this. <laughs> Happy baby, single leg. and breathe. Three, two, and one. Switch sides, grab that left foot. I'm grabbing on the inside, you can grab on the outside, pull down.
three, two, and one. Feet wide. Just get close to the wall and let gravity do the work for you. You relax, just focus on breathing into that stomach, into the lower belly. All right, that's time. Nice work. We have one more little thing we're gonna do here and we're gonna call it a day. Hopefully you're feeling a little taller. <laughs> yeah, that's what I need. All right, let's start with an upward dog, okay? You can stay here with those knees down if you'd like or if you want, you can come up off of those, just onto your toes a little bit off of the thighs and knees and shins looking up. Don't go too far if you need to stay down or even just stay in a cobra here, okay? All right, we're gonna come this way. Gently, I want you to bring those legs up and over, okay? Palms down, be careful. Don't go too far. For some of us, it might be here, okay? Maybe, maybe you just need to hug your legs here, okay? Find a position for you. Here we go. This time, we're gonna do a bow pose. I want you to grab your ankles, pull against, like, pressure. I'm pulling on my ankles and I'm trying to get, and pulling with my ankles against my arms, okay? So I'm resisting the pull against each other here. Good, release. Back on your back for one more, either hug here or you can alternate single leg hug or let's bring those legs up over your head here. Good, lower down gently, maybe one leg at a time. Reach arms overhead, give it a deep breath. Good, all right, that's it today for my stretch. Again, I hope we're feeling taller. I'm only about 5'1", so anything I can do to keep reaching high, <laughs> I need to be doing, no. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. You have a good day. Thank you for joining me for this quick stretch routine. Have a good day.